This is ABC's World News Now. Hello to our fans online. I'm Diana Perez. And I'm Ryan Smith with the top stories on this Tuesday, May 27th. A memorial service is planned on the UCSB campus today for the six students killed Friday night. Makeshift memorials have cropped up on at each of the crime scenes as the official investigation gets underway. And we've learned that Elliot Rogers parents were rushing to see him when they heard the news of his deadly rampage. Elliot was found dead in his car, apparently having taken his own life. The videos he left behind are a chilling legacy. A tornado has slammed into North Dakota, injuring at least nine people, one of them critically. The National Weather Service says the twister hit a camp of oil field workers. Fifteen trailers were severely damaged. Trailer parks like these are growing as the state's oil boom continues to outpace available housing. And search crews will be out again today looking for three men who are missing after that huge mudslide in Colorado. The search has been slowed because only the lower third of the slide is stable. And even at the edges, the mud is 20 to 30 feet deep. It's believed to be several hundred feet deep and about a half mile wide. And hang on tight and strap on your parachute for this one. We say that because of what Daredevil stuntman Andy Lewis has been up to. Take a look. There he is, up 4,000 feet in the air. His GoPro camera captured his walk between two hot air balloons, but that's not it. Of course not. He then did that. Lewis jumped off, parachuting safely to the ground. Certainly not something any of, I, any of us want to do anytime soon. Whoa. No, thank you. Nope. Yikes. All right. <laughs> we'll get your, your news and more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Diana Perez. And I'm Ryan Smith. Thanks for watching. This is ABC's World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. Every day, more Americans choose ABC News, America's number one news source.